You know, you want instant success and well, that's just not how it works. We just continue to stress to our guys, believe in the process. We're gonna win games, but there has to be a belief. You have to look around the room and start believing in each other because you know it takes a team to win. I will tell you something that will happen today. They will not pinch and pop and get a fast break goal in five seconds on. And we're gonna prove that to ourselves. And once we prove that, then everything that we're talking about is all doable, right? High point is a legitimate top ten team in Division One men's lacrosse, and and we got educated. You know, it kind of felt like we were freshmen in high school and we were trying to take our master's degree in college. What did we take from that? Uh, we took, you know what, that's the speed, that's the quick decision, that's the communication, that's high-end Division I men's lacrosse. I think the bus ride home, you know, we kind of realized like, hey, like, it's not a vacation, like we're here for business. You know, it's definitely cool to, you know, be on the road and you know, have the road trips and fun with the boys, but we're there for one reason, it's to get one. We're all freshmen, pretty much, and we're getting better. I mean, it's gonna be, it's obviously gonna be a challenge, but you know, we just gotta keep working hard and prove people that we can compete. Um, you know, freshmen at other schools can get away with things. They can have, you know, bad practices and kind of get away with it because, oh, he's a freshman. Well, in our conference, they don't care that we're freshmen. Nobody cares how old you are, what grade you're in, how, how good or bad you are. They just want to beat you. So we can't be freshmen, the typical freshmen. Uh, we need to just be better. We're very skilled, we're athletic, we have a lot of the pieces of the puzzle, but we can't play pinned. We have to play with confidence. We have to know the next evolution on a clear, the next evolution on an offense. We have to know the slide packages and we have to perform them like we've done it for three years. But we haven't done it for three years. But we have to play like it. And I feel our guys have the capability to play that way. And that's what we're going to count on for Saturday night. Uh, we're looking forward to put on a show for uh, everyone here uh, against Detroit. We keep getting better day by day. I think people have seen that through the first three games. We just want to get a one. You know, it would mean a lot to so many people who put so many hours and to make this program what it is and get the first home game. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be sweet. Can't wait. I keep thinking about, you know, what that's going to be, and I can't tell you. I might shed a tear. I'm a softy at times when it comes down to that. But I might shed a tear because it's been a long journey to get to this point, and to see them out there and know that we were able to create this, there's some real satisfaction in that. I think it's going to be a, an amazing experience. It's going to be a reality on this campus that, uh, you know, St. Bonaventure men's lacrosse is back, this rebirth, and, and what an exciting time. Not many people can say, you know, we made something out of nothing. A lot of people go to established Division One programs and, you know, carry on the tradition there, but we wanted to make that happen here. We're obviously new and we're young. We definitely proved that we can compete. We're here to, you know, make some noise. Oh,